Hi guys, welcome back to 100% Max. So here is your match preview heading into the game against Burnley on Monday night, and it's going to be an 8 p.m. kickoff from Turf Moor. Now heading into this game, we'll currently sit 14th in the table, uh, but Rafa will be a little bit cautious heading into this game as we could slide down to 18th, depending on results uh, elsewhere over the weekend. Although the four teams that could move above us are also playing away games as well. Now Rafa has confirmed that Paul Dummett won't be available uh, following him coming back from the Welsh camp uh, with an unspecified leg injury so he won't be available for the game. Other players that won't be available for the game is Yoshimutsu uh, who's just returned from Japan uh, so he's going to be unavailable uh, and also Jamal Lascelles and John Joe Shelby who are still unavailable to play uh, after picking up the injuries in the game against Wafad and then the missing out on the game against Bournemouth. Uh, and also Florin Lege 1 and Jamie Sterry as well remain out, but Lege 1 is back training with the first team after having his knee surgery. Now, since a 3 0 home win over Wigan in December of 2012, Newcastle played 10 Premier League Monday night matches in front of the cameras, losing every single one of them. And the most recent one being April of this year against Everton at Goodison Park, where we lost 1 0. Our last Premier League away point in a Monday night a live TV game came in a 2 2 draw against Everton a, in September of 2012. A, and one has to return to the, back to October of 2011. And Denver Bars treble in a 3 1 win at Stoke for the last victory. Uh, Newcastle did win twice on Monday night uh, during the 16 17 championship season when we beat uh, both Preston North End and Aston Villa at St James's Park. Now, heading into this game, looking at the Bur uh, Burnley side, Johan Goodmanson and Stephen Defoe could return, but Ben Gibson, James Tarkowski, Stephen Ward and Nick Pope remain in the treatment room. Now, Sean Dyche's side are winless in their last five games, taking maximum of points just once in five home games this season. A 4-0 win over Bournemouth. Now, the referee heading into this game is going to be Anthony Taylor uh, from Manchester. A second appearance this season, following on from the 3-2 defeat at Old Trafford when Newcastle were leading the game, then Man United got back into it. Newcastle's most recent victory in a game ref by Taylor was the 2-1 home win against Arsenal back in April of this year. Now, with all that being said, I think Newcastle's got a very good chance of coming away with a point here at the end of the day. Like I said, Sean Dyche has said a winless in the last five games. Newcastle's on a bit of a win streak at the minute, and if we can keep that win streak going, then we can claim the table. And that is what I want to see from Newcastle. I want to see we're Keep that win streak going. Try and get it as many wins as we can under our belt. And let's climb the table. Get away from that relegation battling uh, problem. Uh, and let's try and finish mid-table if we can. Let us know what you think down in the comments below. Let us know your score predictions down in the comments below. Until next time, remember to like, share, subscribe to the channel. Also remember to follow my sponsor down in the description below. Fanvibe.com uh, if you click the link and use the link, I get a small kickback, so you'll be helping my channel out in the process. Until next time, I'll see you all later.